the game to see the boxing boys. I need you guys. I'm not a fucking one. He's not a one man show. Sean Zatel, boxingvoice.com, here with rugged welterweight contender Chris Van Heerden right after a hell of a fight here in downtown Las Vegas where you were able to get the victory Chris how do you feel after this grueling fight I'm truly blessed by the hands of Jesus Christ and that's it I knew coming into this fight I'm gonna have the victory I knew what I felt it I knew the Lord is gonna bless me with victory this would not have been but possible if it wasn't for Jesus Christ that's first level secondly I knew I got the victory going into the fight I knew it's gonna be a tough fight it was it was close I gave him four out of the ten rounds I gave him four four six and uh, I knew I've got the victory. I just hope the judges give it the right way. When, in the big, first half of the fight especially, you were making a miss and boxing really well. Was that second half of the fight tougher than the first half? Uh, it was tougher, you got to know, you know what, to move for 10 rounds like I did and throw as many punches as I did for 10 rounds, it was tough. So going into the second half, I, I, I took off for a little bit because I knew going into 10, uh, 9 and 10, I got I to gotta work. Right. And that's what we did. So. Um, the first half was beautiful, second half I took a little bit off, just saving a little bit of energy because I've never thrown, thrown so many punches in my life. Was that the best fight you've been in your career in terms of action? Or? In terms of action, yes. That was non-stop, I believe that was non-stop action. And, 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 uh, that, was, that was only because of a great team. My coach, Coach Eric, Eric Brown. and Coach Gillian, we worked so hard for this. And, you know, also, uh, he, was, he was coming forward all night, but at the end of the day, does it seem like you got the decision because you were hitting him with the cleaner shots as he was coming in? That's it. We, we looked at his fights, and that's what Clegg is known of. That's why they call him a dragon. He comes. Yeah. He comes. And it was up to me to, to, to throw sponges and move, 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 move. And I believe that is what we did, and I believe we did it successfully. Was that the, the game plan drawn yes. up by Eric, Coach Eric yes. Brown Coach here? Eric yeah. Brown and Jillian, we worked in the gym that he's going to come at you, tap him with the jab, move, move, move. Don't stop punching. That was the game plan, and we executed the game plan. I feel I did better than what I expected. Chris, it was a treat to watch ringside. Uh, uh, obviously, Steve wants a rematch. Could could we get a return match here at the downtown? Well, you know what? There's no need for me to stay back right now. Now I want to see what's an offer for me. You know what? I've been in. I, I'm in my career to about down the line. We can have a rematch. Right. If, if 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 this time it's on my terms. I came here on his terms. Next time it's on my terms. Hey, do you more than deserve that? Thank you so much for your time, Chris. Thank you. Thank you.